there's really, really too much people that attend English college presently and uh, that choose to live in English afterwards. Yeah, there's a lot of Francophones, of course, but um, in the hallways, they'll speak French. Uh, outside of school, they'll speak French. I, I still use French. I'm, I'm bilingual, of course. In an effort to increase enrollment in French CGEPs, the Legault government's Bill 101 reform proposes to cap at 17.5% the number of students permitted to attend English language CGEPs in the province. There is nothing in our reading of the bill so far that suggests that um, uh, Francophone and Allophone students uh, are uh, not going to, to, to be a part of, of uh, the Vanier community in the future. French is declining, unfortunately, uh, for French-speaking people. Uh, even with the law 101. Uh, so that's why the government, I think, wants to, uh, to, to, to make such a law. Um, but the truth is that it doesn't even go uh, far enough. To some extent, uh, you know, we, we, we understand that uh, the French language in, in Montreal needs to, to be protected. Um, and we also understand that uh, this is the time that the demographics are really going to play a role uh, in this, because as you, as you may or may not know, uh, there was a bit of a baby boom in the mid-2000s. And so those students are going to be arriving uh, in CEGEPs uh, in the next couple of years. The proposal is part of Bill 96, a 100-page legislation that will bring changes to the Charter of the French Language, better known as Bill 101. The reforms also stipulate that as enrollments increase, the increase in English CGEPs would be limited to 8.7% of new spots. The 17.5 uh, seems to correspond to our actual numbers, okay, the, the legal limit we have um and this 8.7 will allow us to grow but obviously at, at, at a more restricted rate we must uh, make the difference between individual bilingualism and institutional bilingualism everybody is for individual bilingualism as i can prove myself right now but institutional bilingualism is a problem in quebec because it sends a message that you can choose whatever you want you can speak English or French. And, and that's not the message we want to send. We want to send that the common public language is French. And that doesn't ch change anything about your, your individual languages. You can learn two, three, four, five languages. I think it's better to offer English higher education here in Quebec, uh, where there are at least French classes, um, rather than uh, kind of limiting its access and then risking having Quebecers actually go out of province. In Montreal, Sasha Obis, City News.